This presentation is brought to you by Pocket Oracle. The definitive quick pocket reference to Oracle. In this session we will see about some performance tuning tips for an Oracle database. Let's have a look at the top 10 mistakes found in Oracle systems. 1. Bad connection management. Connecting too many times is one of the most common mistake. 2. Bad use of cursors and the shared pool. 3. Badly coded SQL. 4. Use of non-standard initialization parameters. 5. Getting database I.O. wrong. 6. Redo log set to problems. 7. Serialization of data blocks in the buffer cache due to lack of free lists, free list groups, transaction slots, or shortage of rollback segments. 8. Long full table scans. 9. High amounts of recursive SQL. And 10. Deployment and migration errors. Now let's look at the golden rules for performance tuning. Change one thing at a time and then measure the differences. Tuning individual SQL may yield little performance. The number of executions of the SQL may be the problem. Now I am going to show you some database tuning tips. Do as little as possible. Focus on simplifying the processes instead of achieving a theoretical design perfection. Avoid multiple I.O. to the database, bundle queries to a procedure and call them in your application. Again in procedures reduce I.O. to the DB. Avoid multiple connections to the DB, connecting to the DB is the slowest process. Store data the way you need it. Go atomic, divide and conquer. Use partitions, local indexes. Spread data across disks. Use different table spaces for tables and indexes and partitions. Use MVs, reduce operations performed on tables. Use parallelism, almost everything can be parallelized. Avoid the need to query undo segments. It need to look multiple locations for a piece of data. Always keep statistics updated. Use disk catching. Use larger block size. This keeps more data in the memory. Make sure blocks are densely packed. Adjust PCT free. Also mind row chaining and migration. Try to perform sorts in memory. Use a CPU with small number of fast processors. Use standard initialization params. Use proper use of redo logs and checkpoints. Have sufficient rollback segments. Small tables can be kept in the key pool using the buffer pool clause of create table statement. Always be free from deployment and migration errors. Let's see a few tips for tuning SQLs. Avoid unnecessary sorts. Use union all. Use compute stats while creating index. Always hint when needed. Avoid partition products. These affect the performance badly. Avoid full table scans on large tables. Use indexes. Avoid joining too many tables. Use SQL standards and conventions to reduce parsing. Try to use index calls in the WHERE clause. Use compound indexes with care do not repeat columns. Skips can index to use a composite index even if the leading column is not a limiting condition in the SQL. Monitor index browning due to deletions. Rebuild as necessary. Use literals in the WHERE clause use bind variables. Monitor v$dollar session long ifs to detect long running operations. Use the shared cursor parameter. Finally test correctly, with large volumes and large number of users. Thanks for watching the presentation. For a quick reference of Oracle concepts visit pocketoracle.blogspot.com.